So, welcome back, and you join me in lovely central London traffic. And today we're taking the Z4 for its first proper out in, other than the little review video, to um, Surrey Rolling Road. So if you remember, and I'll put links somewhere if I can, or they'll be in the description below, that I took the Mark II TT after it had been tuned to Surrey Rolling Road, and I took the Mark III TTS to Surrey Rolling Road. So the plan is to take the Z4 to Surrey Rolling Road today, whack it on the dyno, get some like numbers on it, before we start the full, get some bolt on bits, um, obviously a stage one, sorting out this exhaust, etc, etc, etc. So yeah, this is the start of this journey really with this car, I'm, I'm excited about this one to be fair, I've sort of been in a bit of, like I said previously, I've been in a bit of limbo, a little bit in my own head, but I'm back, rejuvenated, ready to go, and ready to get this project started really, so Hopefully, if this traffic ever moves, because I'm already running late, which is just typical, if this traffic gets going, we'll get to Surrey Rolling Road, we'll get the Z4 on the dyno, we'll see it next, and then after, we'll jump back in and we'll have a little talk about the numbers and what we're going to do to improve them. So I think this one, factory, where this is the 35i S-Drive, should be 306 from factory standard um, but we'll see in it who knows I mean could be more could be less I think it needs it needs a good service so that could affect it so we'll see let's let's get it there and we'll see what the numbers say see what the dyno says I'll catch you when we get there if we ever get there longer than a few minutes later knowledgeable about all this stuff far 
far, far, far more knowledgeable than me, which as we know, as you sure you said in the comments, isn't very hard, but easy to deal with. I emailed them in the week. Uh, they should come down Saturday, put me straight in, got me straight on, did the runs. Um, that's my phone, cancel them. Yeah, no, thank you. Yeah, got me straight on, did the runs, happy as Larry. And um, easy, we're in, we're out, we're back on the road. As you see, the car's currently running 312 bhp, which I think is a really good starting point. Hopefully, we'll be able to get up to like the 400 ish mark with not a lot, a lot of work. A few bolt on mods, little stage one, and we should be there. As we are undertaken by a Mercedes from Mercedes. Choice driving there, should we say? Um, yeah, so hopefully we'll get up to 400 ish, like a stage one, function kit. I need to do something about this exhaust, it's, it's overly loud for being loud sake, which I find quite annoying. It's a bit droney on the road, you might even be able to hear it now. So, hopefully, I can do something about that. I need to get underneath and have a look at it. I don't know what the cats look like, I don't know what they've done to it, I don't know what it is. It might be like a just a, a bolt on exhaust or something, but I don't know. So, I need to have a, a good look at that. Uh, while we was putting it on the dyno, we noticed one of the rear arms is severely bent, which I think I might have done. Let's see that the better. Obviously, we'll be replacing that. That will be an upcoming video. Um, yeah, like I said, we'll be stage one there. That'll be a video. Induction kit, that'll be a video. Uh, we'll change the wheels. We're going to de chrome it. I'd like to upgrade this, this steering wheel. I'd like to fully recover the interior. But I do sort of like this cream, but it's a bit bad. Car's quite old. So maybe get recovered. Maybe like black Alcantara. Something like that. I'd like to. Like get all the, the wood panels on the dash, uh, get carbon fiber ones. Obviously, we want to update the infotainment system, get Apple CarPlay, etc. So, I'd like to retain the factory screen. So, if anyone's got any good ideas, companies, or gadgets, wherever I can fit myself uh, for, the, for the screen to re make, uh, retain it, but to get Apple CarPlay and stuff, I'll be open to that. Upgrade the audio in here, upgrade the wheels, suspension, brakes, that full hog. This car, and I know I say this a lot, people will cuss me in the comments because they love that, but I will be keeping this one for a while. The next one after this one, I plan to be something crazy. That's why this one I've sort of maybe bought something a bit more affordable just so I can save. It leaves me the extra money to save for the next car, which I want to be set crazy. Maybe I'll finally get my GTR, my R35. Maybe I'll finally get an R8, who knows? I like Esther Martin, so, but something, yeah, something of that sort of caliber, that sort of level, will be the next, next car that I get. But this car will be hanging around for a while. So if anyone's got any ideas, what they would like me to do with it, any, any tips, any help in the comments, you know, it'd be greatly appreciated. I will full on deaf ears. I reply to all comments, as people know, if they're nice, if they're calling me fat and black, then yeah, I already know that. So, um, yeah, just get in the comments. And I just wanted to say as well, again, thank you to Sorry Rolling Road. And thank you to everyone that stayed subscribed during this little hiatus that I've had. I'm sure, I understand life gets in the way, things get in the way. I do YouTube because I enjoy it and it gives me a reason to mess about with my car. I don't like get a great amount of money from it, if any. Um, so, yeah, so sometimes life has to get in the way, right? Work has to get in the way, I'm sure you all understand. But I'm so thankful for everyone that's still been watching the videos, everyone that stayed subscribed, everyone that's been messaging me, checking in, making sure I'm okay. Um, all my guys in my TT groups and all that. I'm sure a TT of some kind will be back on the channel 
soon enough because I love them guys, I love the group and I love the car. But um, yeah, just thank you to everyone that stayed subscribed. If you're not subscribed, please click the subscribe. Really, really helps motivate me to make these videos and really helps me get new opportunities and um, new, new avenues um, to explore for the car stuff. So really, 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 really helps. So yeah, like I said, thank you to everyone. Stay watching, stay subscribed. Plenty more to come with this car. Plenty more to come in general. I am gonna try and do a little road trip in this car, definitely. So yeah, like I said, plenty, plenty, plenty happening. And um, yeah, I'll catch you on the next one.